What's up guys, this is Omega Liar, and today I'm bringing you a very, very short gameplay using the PKP Passion Egg, a gun that you've probably never seen before, never heard of, or something like that, because really no one ever uses it, and it's not terrible, but it's just not that good, uh, especially compared to like the L86 and the MG36 in the LMG category. Um, and obviously, uh, it's something, a big event that just came was the Black Ops 2 trailer, it's officially Black Ops 2. And uh, as much as I want to talk about that, I would rather do a trailer breakdown and show you what I find in the trailer, um, as opposed to just talking about it. Because I think it's better if you see the trailer yourself, which I'm sure most of you have. And I also think it's better if uh, you have it in front of you while I'm breaking down what's going on. Um, so what I do want to talk about today, though, in this very quick commentary, I think this is actually the perfect length, is why Modern Warfare 3 struggles to be a fantastic game. Um, it's it's not, th it's not that this game is bad by any means, but it's frustrating for all the wrong reasons. Um, for instance, the little things in this game can really get to you. Uh, the, first, uh, the first example would be the most blatant one, and that's just the gun balance is off. They could be good. They could fix it. They could um, adjust recoil. They could adjust aim down sights time. They could adjust mobility. They can, I don't know about fire rate, but um, they can adjust all of these things. And they have, but they've just not done it for the right guns. Certain guns are just too weak to be used, aka the AA-12, the SPAS-12, the uh, Model 1887. Um, and certain guns are too powerful, and most people use them, aka the Type 95 and the PP-90 and MP-7. And then you have all those guns in the middle that don't stand out on either direction. And it, it creates these certain, a lot of situations that get really frustrating. Um, if you really enjoy the guns that are underpowered, it's impossible to use them, and that becomes frustrating. And if you enjoy the guns that are overpowered, well, one, you're probably going to do pretty well for no good reason, and you're going to piss a lot of people off, creating frustrating situations for other people. So that's the first aspect where things can get frustrating in this game. But then you get to smaller things. For one, the scoreboard that everyone's been, been, been complaining about since the game came out. Uh, that was the first thing that everyone noticed. Uh, I mean... Just the fact that they didn't, they did a downgrade. They downgraded after two years of develop, developing a game with the same engine that it had before, same graphics, a lot of same glitches too, like the USP Akimbo having a stupid fast knife. And the, the fact that they couldn't just add in that scoreboard is, it's ridiculous. They, they really did not spend enough time on this game. And, um, I mean, I'm sure most of you would agree. And I hope, hopefully, this doesn't sound like I'm venting. I really don't do that too much. But it's small stuff like that. And then you get to slightly bigger things, like theater mode. I only have 30 seconds to explain this, but I had a gameplay with this exact gun that I wasn't recording for. I went 45 and 5. I was looking extremely far to posting at 9KD with a gun that no one ever uses. And I went to, get to, I went to theater mode to get the recording. Gone. Does not exist. Said the la I did this. I found got this gameplay afterwards because I was so frustrated, um, and none of it works. It was just gone. And I'll, that's not the first gameplay I lost, but that's all the time I have, and it's just frustrating. So if you like this, comment, right, subscribe, and I'll see you. Sorry, my outro got a little bit cut off. I didn't time that right, but that's not the only gameplay I lost. I also lost a very, very, very good Scar gameplay, a good PM9 gameplay, and all this great stuff just because the theater mode doesn't even want to register the fact that I played them. I play. I was playing this past Saturday, and I said the last game I played was April 21st, which was not this past Saturday. So, um, tell me what you guys think. And anyway, if you like this video, comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you in my next commentary. And as always, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it.